Hello guys, welcome back to the channel. Today I want to do a review of the new snap-on screwdrivers. They decided to put the put most of the screwdrivers in this cushion divider. Uh, before I get started, I'll let you guys know the model number. So I have F M S G D zero one B R, and I'm going to assume the R would mean would stand for the red. So if you ask me about another color, I would just say the last letter R is for the red. So if you want a green, it, it probably is going to be B G, blue B B so on and so forth i'm just guessing guys so maybe look it up online and you find the correct model number let me know you just got to find a place to put them in your box so i picked the red because a lot of my tools in my box is red i'm just a creature of habit but on the truck, I remember they had orange, green, and if I remember right, they might, they might have had yellow, but don't call me on the yellow. So before I get too far, I show you the part number, uh, FMSGD01BR. And I'm gonna say the R stands for red. So if you wanna look up another color, change the last letter so where they have it they got your Phillips on one side and your flathead or slotted on the other side so you can turn this whichever way you want you know if, for what if whatever you do you know maybe you need a Phillips most of the time you know so I like me, I use Phillips a lot, so I got them turned like this. And I just run in there and grab me a Phillips. So, it looks like the highest, the biggest size we have is the number four. And it steps down. Number three. Number two. And then it starts, and it has a number one. And I see a zero. So it has them in different sizes, different lengths for different applications. I like to use I like to use these smaller ones. Cause I deal with a lot of terminals. Terminating wires and stuff like that. And actually, the price on these, you know what, I'm not gonna say the price because I know it's different in different areas. So I, I just advise you guys to check with your franchisee or look it up online. But I have seen these on eBay going close to 400 bucks. In order for me, for me to get these, I did some uh, trading with my franchisee. And I actually traded in my old set. And my old set actually was, I want to say without the two larger uh, flathead and Phillips. And then I didn't have the minis, the four minis in my old set. So in the flathead, 
or slide it, have you call it. Looks like you have a 55, 50, 40, 35, 316th and an eighth. We got our two stubbies. We got a 40 and number two. One thing I like about the snap-on screwdrivers, I've never had the warranty one. And I like that you can put a wrench here. If you got like a screw or something you're trying to get out, I'll put a wrench here. It magnifies my torque. And I have, I will admit, I've had, have, you know, hit on the back of them, but not using it as a chisel. I've used it as, let's say I have a stubborn screw I'm trying to get out. So I got a wrench here and I'm trying to apply pressure here, but I use a mallet and tap on it with my wrench and then the mallet, it, it normally breaks free. It's either gonna break free or it's gonna break the head. And if you're like me, if you break the head off a screw, it's probably meant to be. That's why I look at it. I don't look at it as something that I did wrong or anything like that. I just figure if it didn't come off with just a hand screwdriver, it was meant to break. Let me know down in the comments what you think about that statement. <laughs> so anyways, I decided to bring these home. See how I looked in my box. Actually, I'm thinking about buying a second set. But if I know me, I know myself. Since they're red, I'm gonna put them back in my Epic at my job. And probably buy me another color for home.